When you don't want to sacrifice comfort for weight, be sure to bring along the Nimbus air mat on your next backcountry trek. To use your air mat, first get the Nimbus out of the included stuff sack. Check and see if the valves are tight. If they aren't, make sure they are tight so that you don't have any issues with your mat leaking. Next, unroll the mat so you can start inflating. Place the air mat upside down. Open the black cap so that the foam in the built-in pump can start expanding. Cover the hole with the palm of your hand and using both hands, pump up and down until the mat is fully inflated. You can obviously adjust the amount of air you put into the mat to the firmness that you prefer. The first time inflating your mat, or possibly after storing it for a long period of time, you may have to be a little more forceful on your first pump to allow the valve to fully open. Then, simply close the cap, flip the mat over, and it's ready to use. The Nimbus is offered in a regular size as well as a long size. Both sizes inflate in just over a minute. The regular size is 20 by 72 by 3.5 inches, and the long is 24 by 77 by 3.5 inches. The regular only weighs 20 ounces, and the long weighs in at 25 ounces. With this light of a mat and how small they pack up, bringing along a Nimbus air mat is essential for a comfortable night's sleep. The fabric is an ultra lightweight ripstop for long term durability and the two brass valves allow for a quick and easy deflation. The horizontal tube design featured on the Nimbus series makes for a comfortable sleeping area. Should you have any issues, a repair kit is included so you don't have to worry about buying any accessories. When it's time to get things packed away, open both valves and air will immediately start being released. Fold it in half to force out any excess air. To make your packed size as small as possible, flip the air mat over and open the black cap and compress the foam in the pump without covering the hole and reclose the cap. Fold the mat in half, roll it up, and re-tighten the valves. It's as easy as that. Thank you for taking time to learn more about our Nimbus series. 